Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to limit a text element to one line only. As an example, we're going to use this website and as you can see, some of the book titles are very long and it doesn't really look very nice, it breaks the layout. So I have decided to limit the book title to one line only. Thankfully, it's very easily achievable with CSS, which is always a good news. And I have prepared here two little snippets. So for the actual shortening, you're going to use only this one. I will post both in a description. So the first thing you need to do is find the class or an ID of the element that you wish to manipulate. I have a video on this. Um, I will link to it in the description as well. So first thing we're going to do is to put all the content, the entire title, in just one line. In order to achieve that, we can use a property white space with value no wrap. This will basically result in one endless line. The second thing we need to do is to hide the content that is that overflows our element. And for that, we're going to use the property overflow with the value hidden. And the third thing we need to do um, I want to indicate to my users that a book title is actually longer. And for that, I'm going to put three little dots at the end of the line. In order to do that, you use text overflow pro property with value ellipsis. So let's save this and refresh the website. And as you can see, here we go. The title is in one line only. In the second part of the video, I want to display full title to users who hover over the title. In order to do that, we need to bring all our properties from the first part to their original values on hover. So again, there goes your class or ID, a hover element, and then reset all the values. Let's save that. Let's refresh the website. And test it out. It works. There you go. This is how you limit a text element to one line with only CSS. If you found this tutorial useful, please like my video. It will mean the world to me. And to get notified about new content, simply subscribe and turn on the notifications. I'll see you in the next video.